Hello everyone, welcome to Prestige Castle Farm. My name is Innocent. Um, today we'll be discussing a very important topic on how to palpate your rabbit. What are the benefits of palpating your rabbit? Um, so to go ahead with this video, I invited um, one of our fellow farmer who is very experienced and very knowledgeable to come do this video with us. Um, I invited him to my farm to assist in palpating my rabbit. I'm not very good with palpating. Um, sometimes I get it right, sometimes I don't get it. Um, but there are um, experienced, experienced farmers uh, who are very, very good at palpating. They could tell you, they, they could even tell you when the rabbit would even give birth. They would, they could tell you the number of, you know, bonies that the rabbit is having. Um, so I invited Pastor Tayo, Pastor Tayo, to the farm. I'm not sure if you guys know of Pastor Tayo, but we've, we've been to his farm, we've interviewed him um, in his farm, and his insight is very, very useful. If you've not watched that video, please scroll down on our channels, you'll see one of the videos. So, this is Pastor Tayo. Welcome, welcome, Pastor Tayo. Welcome. Yeah. So, um, this is Pastor Tayo. Um, so, we'll be making some demonstration on how to palpate the rabbit um, unfortunately um, the person who assists my assist me with the camera is not around so we just do with what we have because this video is very important pastor tayo is a very busy person so to get him to come to my farm you know it's not an easy thing so we'll be showing some demonstration uh with um the rabbit we'll be showing some demonstration with the rabbit we have um, so, and then we'll be asking Pastor Tyro some question. I will be at the back end of the camera. So I'll be just, I'll be videoing Pastor Tyro while he does the demonstration. He will show us, he will tell us what are the benefits of papating, um, how you can papate. Um, you may not be able to get it perfectly, but at least you should be able to get some, um, insight on what papating is and how to. Uh, myself i'm still not very good at it so if you're struggling like myself it's okay uh, we're all learning um so um the likes of that's why we have the likes of pastor tayo who is very very experienced he's a legend and i mean if you are in a quiet home state and you are into uh, rabbit farming and you've not heard of pastor tayo then probably you're not um you've not done your research properly so um let's start so i'll be at the back end of the camera and uh pastor tayo will just be showing us some demonstration please stay tuned all right okay so okay. you want to palpate you don't need to allow the rabbit do not allow the rabbit to struggle with you make sure the rabbit is calm then you lift the rabbit up a little bit then place your if you are using right hand or left hand i'm using right hand but to palpate i can easily bring my sense to my left fingers mm. so that i can palpate so I place my fingers under the abdomen, abdomen, then try pressing gently, not too hard, on the rabbit, so I can feel the the inside of the belly. So that's how to palpate. Yeah. So what do you what do you feel inside? Like what? Yes, I feel the 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 foot is inside. Okay. Yes, and uh, yeah. And how do, how do they look? Is it like a round yes belly. they look round yes okay. round and it depends on the size the okay. age okay so the age too determines so if it is within let's say 10 12 days mm. sometimes it will be like the size of the of the apu mm. depending on the size of the rabbit mm. it will be like the size of the apu mm. so if you are not too good you may mistake the poo for the Mm. Which is, but if you are good, if you know that it is poo, mm. because the area which you find the poo is different from the area where you find the mm. the, the developing uh, baby inside. Mm. So now, if it is more than two weeks, mm. the size will increase. Okay. And if it is more than three weeks, definitely you should be feeling something like almost a fully formed uh, rabbit inside. Mm. Uh -huh. So that is how I determine. Sometimes. Mm. People will invite me to their farm. By the yeah. time I feel, I'm just telling them this thing is two, two weeks. Mm. And they will take their reference and you are a witch. Yeah. <laughs> no, it's not a witch. It's just that I'm bringing my sense to my finger to feel yeah. the size. Okay. Even without being there when you do the mating and mm. with the size that I can find there, no matter the size of the rabbit, I will use the size of the rabbit too to judge 
mm. the size, the age. Yes. Because the size of the baby inside a big rabbit like this, even mm. if it is two weeks, mm. may be the size of three weeks in a smaller rabbit. Mm. Yeah. Mm. But I will, then I will still tell you this rabbit, if you don't even know the date, I will tell you, okay, mm. prepare your box in mm. so so date. date. I'll just add maybe four days extra mm. within that four days. Mm. If you prepare your box, yeah. you will definitely have your results. And what, what are the mistakes some, some people can make like when they are trying to palpate their rabbit? Like Yes, it's like when you, if you want to palpate some, we say, oh, I'm not too good like uh, my mm. boss, we said, Mr. Mm. Innocent. He <laughs> <No. laughs> said, I'm not too good with palpate. It's because you are not patient enough. Yes. Eh? So yes. when you want to palpate the rabbit, don't allow the rabbit to struggle. When the rabbit is struggling, yes. the belly will be strong, so mm. you'll be able to feel, feel it. it. Yes, okay. and allow the rabbit to rest. Not some people will place it up like this. I'm not mm. doing that, mm. but yet I can still feel mm. if the rabbit is calm. Mm. It's even better if the rabbit is calm. But if the rabbit is not calm, it's not calm. Mm. If the rabbit should struggle, it will scratch you the way the other one scratched Scratch you. you. Okay. Yeah. So you allow the. That's why I will, I will advise you let the hind leg, is it hind leg, yes. be placed on the floor so that the rabbit will not struggle. Mm. Then gently, you you will feel it definitely. Mm. Mm. If you are calm, patient enough, mm. yeah, my grandmother do call me patient <laughs> <laughs> because of the way I do things. So, <laughs> so when you are calm enough, yeah. you can actually get it. Get it. Okay. And so, what what are the benefit of palpating? What are the benefits? Yeah. If you palpate, you will maximize your time. Okay. For instance, now if you can palpate, you cross your rabbit on the first of January. Yes. For example, mm. instead of you waiting till it at the first of January or second of February, yes. By ten days, you would have done that. I know this rabbit is pregnant, and yes. it's not pregnant. Mm. You would have crossed. Look at how many days you have saved. Mm. Like twenty days or more. Yes. <laughs> Even within that twenty days, I believe you cross on the tenth again. That okay, this rabbit is not pregnant. Mm. In the next ten days of February, you have you got instead of you waiting another. Or it may if, if you don't know how to pop it, you mm. cross on the first mm. before you can get under it. I mean, be ending of March. March. Mm. Meanwhile, early February, you've gotten what you need. Yes. So basically, it, it helps you save time. Yes. Help you save time. And also, not only saving time, mm. saving my feeding. As well, right? Because mm. the rabbit that I'm feeding, mm. you should pay for the feeding and pay for the house rent. <laughs> yes, <laughs> now, like my boss was saving you. The rabbit must pay for the rent. Uh, yes. So, if I take my time, my money to build a cage or hutch mm. for my rabbit, mm. and the rabbit is just staying there. Yes. Uh, oh. So what is the what is the, the 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 purpose? So really, so one of the 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 things that we've seen with with papeting is, you know, people some if not all farmers can papete like myself. I'm not very good at it. I have tried several times. Sometimes I get it. Sometimes I don't. I don't get it. Um, you know, lioness, Linda Chasin. I don't even know her. Um, no, Linda Chasin, lioness. Is it? She 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 in the group. She's in some of the groups. She okay. called me yesterday. I, I didn't know I knew I would come to your side. Yeah. I would have booked up on your from here. Yes, to good site. Okay. So, not everybody. Yes. But if you are patient enough, you are calm enough, mm. you should be able to do it. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, no problem. Um, thank you, Pastor Tayo, uh, for coming through. I think, I think uh, this video is very, very important because some people like myself, we are not very good at it, you know, even though we've been in the industry now for years and then we, we're still struggling with it, while well, some people are just very good with it. Um, so I hope this video is very useful. Uh, Pastor, could you just maybe do one final demonstration for those who may have not, okay. may, may not get it? You lift, make sure the rabbit is calm, mm. just as you can see, then lift the rabbit by the ear since mm. you are not doing it for a long time mm. just leave it lift it by the ear mm? mm. like this and place your other hand the one that you know you can use very well yes <laughs> though i'm using right hand but mm. my sense can easily come to my left fingers mm. Mm. then you press gently the abdomen gently mm. up if you can't feel anything down yes switch up oh. a little bit okay the photos must have come down Oh, okay. Because they can swim. Okay. If you find them in uh, in this region now, especially when they are within two weeks, yeah. If you remove your hand by the time you put your hand again, they must have yeah. swim from that area to another place. Mm. Then up, then down again. Yeah. By okay. the time you do that like two, three times, you should yeah. be able to feel the the lumps inside. Yeah. Yeah. Something like lumps. Yeah. And some people are afraid because they because um, maybe some people say that that might be one of the. The, the danger of papating is that you may end up 
and if you if you don't do it right, you may end up injuring the the, the fetus. Is that is that the case? Uh, me, I have not had experience with that. If I have confirmed that this rabbit is pregnant, definitely the I should be mm. expecting a safety if I underfed the rabbit or not giving the rabbit attention. The rabbit may recuperate. Mm. So. Okay, okay, okay. So if you have been battling with rabbits that has not taken in, mm. at the end you end up knowing how to properly okay. because that was what happened to me when I was in secondary school. Okay. I bought a rabbit. Yeah. I mean I didn't bought a rabbit, my okay. cousin. Yeah. Uh, the fiancé yeah. got a rabbit and he brought it to our house. Okay. Since he knew I'm um, I have interest in that. So yes. I started nursing the rabbit. Yes. So when it was time for the rabbit to give birth, the rabbit did not give birth. I took the rabbit to another farmer mm. then while I was in secondary school to mate. The yes. rabbit mated, I brought the rabbit back. Mm. Nothing, nothing. Mm. And my auntie <laughs> now we say, Oh, <laughs> you are just laboring for nothing. Yeah. Uh, she said it. I said, Ah. So one day, my auntie, you know, she sells fabrics. Yes. So she now gave me and my cousin, yeah. who is, is uh, her son, yeah. fabrics to go and sell. Yeah. So we say, We now make it. So the game we now join it together, which was 700 and then yes. we now bought a, a book. Okay. Brought it home. Mm. So since then, when the book now, every day I will begin to press the press, 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 press. So when I now found that there was something inside, that was mm, when, when I learned how to do a patient. Oh, okay, okay, okay. <laughs> that, that because makes I had the, the, how do I put it, uh, delays mm. and I was desperate to get. And then you were consistent yes. trying. Okay, yeah. okay. That, that makes sense. That makes sense. So I uh, will put in uh, Pastor Tayo's uh, phone number. Uh, Pastor Tayo is a very, very experienced uh, farmer. He has a lot of uh, rabbit in his own farm so you can reach out to him if you want to get good stock like this you know see how nice this this rabbit is um, so you can reach out to him and he will always um, be able to deliver to you in any state you are in Nigeria so take care of yourself um, and Bye-bye. And also, okay. sorry. Okay. And also, I want to thank those of you who have been calling okay. and for your patronage because yeah. I've been receiving calls yeah. not only in Akwaibo State alone, mm. outside Akwaibo State, Potakot, mm. uh, uh, Enugu, from many states I can't even mention, mm. even from Ogun State, mm. yeah, Lagos State. I want to say thank you. God bless you too. Mm. Take care and bye-bye. Yeah. Bye. Bye.